Hi, my name is Justin Favela. Welcome to my studio. Uh, I'm here to invite you to my show, County Center, at the Clark County Government Center. It opens May 30th. County Center is gonna be uh, about City Center and showing the artwork that's at City Center in the Government Center, but it's a reinterpretation of the work. And I thought about this idea last year, actually, when, you know, everybody was talking about City Center because it was this new, you know, project that MGM put up and um, how kind of how kind of weird and awkward some of the art was at City Center and if it made sense, uh, if it was a good idea. Um, and uh, I think it's I think it's great that there's public art in City Center. It's interesting that you know it's this corporate collection um, and people are critiquing this really uh, weird collection of public art in this in this really awkward setting for it. This uh, is the appropriation of the Henry Moore piece that's at City Center. It's uh, the, the reclining uh, structure piece that's outside of the Aria. Uh, there's a few stories behind it, like people putting their cigarettes out on it and uh, children climbing on it and playing on it. And it's actually to scale. This is as big as uh, the Henry Moore piece is at City Center, but it also uh, isn't an exact three-dimensional um, uh, uh, model of it or, or, or a representation of it. I flattened everything. Uh, it's more because um, taking inspiration from Las Vegas sign design and signage. Um, so it is 3D, but it's also flat at the same time. The materials for the show in County Center are, uh, are important. Uh, uh, cardboard, um, um, it's, uh, it's this throwaway object, you know, everybody uses it, everybody knows what it is, everybody knows the structural integrity of the material. As far as using a material that's recyclable, that's really not that important to me. I mean, it's great that I, I think it's great that I'm recycling, um, but really I just love the way the material looks and it's cheap and I don't have any money, so it's perfect. That's why I use it. For a little while, uh, when I first like started college, I, I couldn't wait to leave Las Vegas. Um, I, you know, because there's no culture here. I need to go somewhere with culture, somewhere with an art museum, blah, blah, blah. You hear it all the time. And, um, but there is a culture here. It's just different. It's, it's just a, it's a new city and, you know, it's a young city and uh, it's just figure, it's like a, it's awkward teenage state right now where it's figuring out its personality or, uh, and, and what it wants to be. I'm really glad that I stuck around and uh, that I'm, I'm learning and uh, from Las Vegas and uh, I think I am making art about Las Vegas, so like, like in this show, for example. The Las Vegas art scene here has really flourished in the past few years, um, but uh, uh, I, think, I, I think it could definitely expand and I think um, people need to realize that art can happen anywhere. It just, it doesn't have to be just in the downtown Las Vegas area, even though it's great that it's there. Um, but the art scene does not need to, it, it does not need to just stay in one district. It could, it, there should be art everywhere here in Las Vegas. There will be a reception on uh, June 2nd and also on first Friday, June 3rd. Uh, I will be giving guided tours at seven o'clock on June 2nd, 3rd and July 1st at 7 p.m. Thanks for stopping by and come uh, check out my show um, and maybe you'll see some of the stuff actually finished. Thank you. <laughs>